There's a developer that develops the dye, and like to do that with henna, you have to do it for like eight hours, like you know, naturally, like with lemon juice or, or like something acidic to break down the blends, and like and then the dye is released, and then you use you use your hair, and like it has to be a certain consistency. It's like this. And then you have to let it sit for four hours. So it's the entire, like from the night before, that's why, because right. it's all natural. There's yeah, no so like, harsh chemicals yeah. speeding up the process. Okay. Right. That's why it took you a half hour. Because <laughs> it's chemicals that are like breaking into your hair to, to break it open like, to, to get the dye it's in like there. Paint. Yeah, it's, it's like paint. Well, it's, bre it's, it's breaking open your hair. It's like breaking open your hair to, to get it in. Speaking of hair, it's beautiful. Hello there. How are you? Very good. How are you? You know when it's like, you know there's nothing to do stuff. Yeah. Just basically. We went to um, the old location of Studio Akata on Friday. Yeah. It's a bar now. It's called The Grant. You're like, you used to sleep here. Yeah. <laughs> there's th in that building, there are three bars there now. Yeah, there's, there's so that like one. Happening corner now? It's kind of happening. They're trying to push it. Like, there's a really expensive restaurant on the corner that's like $90 for a steak. And then they have a wine bar. Wow, so it changed the whole yeah. atmosphere in the they have like, Yeah, they have like valet parking and you know, in the dirt lot. In the lot that we used to park in. Yeah. Um, Heather invited me and yeah. I went to work Friday night. Yeah. It's inter it's it's like a nostalgia thing. It felt like walking through like a mirror into an alternate universe. It's like, wait, this seems familiar. Did they change the structure a lot? Or no. I haven't been in there. No, they have Interesting. It's just color and painted in. So it's all like, it's got a loft still up there? No, it's not open. They have storage up there now. Oh, okay. Yeah. Is that what she has her headphones on? Starting to grow my hair no, back we, we after go, like seven years. Like, <laughs> <laughs> we look very different now, like younger. Yeah, no, younger, yeah. Different look. Yeah. Like, like different. <laughs> yeah. 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 The main, we used to, all the drummers used to get together with him. Yeah. I have good, good times. Yeah. We're all friends. I mean, and honestly, wow. since he left the house, yeah. we haven't been together. The whole part. I know, but you were the hub. Yeah. Yeah. He was the hub. Well, that then people started moving out of the city, like slowly, like Rachel moved, and then, you know, recently Jelena moved, and right. so right. it used to be yes. the Mecca, but then everybody yeah. just moved. It's true. And you moved. <laughs> it was it hard to get over? Because you were used to a very different, like, active, uh, like, uh, 
show no, life. No, I still I still events all the time. Yeah. It, it was a different transition, but um, it was for me personally it was needed. Yeah, you kinda wanted it, I remember you needed to like change. Yeah. yeah. Change things. Change yeah, I mean it's change up. And things in LA are so different, so expensive now. Yeah, exactly. Look at that place. Yeah, exactly. Look at that place. The whole place is gentrified. The whole area is gentrified. Is it good or is it bad? Because like you see, like things that you're saying right mm -hmm. now, things that happen, mm -hmm. but like I just walk this way. And it's like so many different right. spaces. So it's like we're like swirling to a crash, and then like some places are all. It's a very unpredictable situation. You don't know what's happening. I don't know. It's like around here, the Third Street Promenade and stuff. They've made too many rules. Like it would be very difficult for artists to skin or things like that. So those are usually what the creative, the creatives are the ones that plant the seeds and make the soil. You know, viable, yeah. and so when they change all the rules where the creatives can't live in, yeah. they will just stay down. Yeah. How's your mom doing? My mom's doing really good. Um, I she remember how nice yeah. she is, <laughs> and loving and caring. I only met her once. Yeah. She loves the, uh, the little packages that my mom sends. <laughs> <laughs> Candid filming. Everything. It's crazy, isn't it? I work at a high school where they have fights now. It used to be people would kind of back up, and now the kids are with their phones and the flashlights trying to capture it first so they can get it. It's such a bizarre and like. I just figured I would post a little bit saying, hey, I'm Matt. And his drum. You have like nice for skin. You look like you've maintained like a good thing. Thank you. I still have to make it. No way. How are you? I can see it. I'm a photo of the dog. Somebody was there. It's just a this generation. Give me things. I'm Melanie. Yes. My son is the one at the door. I normally do not have this color hair. This is me growing it out. Yeah, it's. it's, it's it used to be this. <laughs> like being Thank you. Yeah. That's what I want to hear about. Are you an artist? Yeah, I get it. I'm, I'm a dancer. Yeah. And, uh, I, I had a feeling you were coming. I'm a dancer, I'm a choreographer, I'm a dancer, I make my own apparel. Oh, that's Yes. Her life is her art. Yes. I love you. Ooh, that's really cool. Uh, that was your what? My attempt during COVID. Am I speaking of Oh, okay. Yeah. It's really cool. It's a beautiful like a deep. Yeah. It's cool. Do you guys know about it? Oh, yeah. I just wanted it to be. I mean, I've been. I've had gray hair. Like, since I was, I've started getting gray hair when I was like 25. And like, by the time I was 30, my entire. Like, surrounding my face. Was great. So I've been dying it for most of my life. Dream? I mean, it frees up time. Sure. It frees up a lot of time. It's 
it, stress, it was stressful and annoying because it like, grows so quickly that like three weeks and I'd already have like. Yeah. So, yeah. She's 18. 18? She's turning 19. 19. She's older than him. No, like, what? She looks young. I don't, I can't tell. You remember tell when she was a no, but they don't well, look, they don't look old enough to have kids. Yeah, much younger. That's great. I just like, I, I'm so mad at ages. I really like, I can't guess that. Hey. I'm good. <laughs> she suddenly remembers. She remembers. <laughs> a, a long time. Yeah. Been a, been a couple years. Jo Joelle and I were dating together for a while. <laughs> Yeah. We were doing, we were, we were rehearsing, um, Joelle, we were rehearsing the, the, um, the red masks, the red veils, and the uh, drum, the harp blue. That's when I, that's when I thought it was going to be I love your jacket. It's really, I, I love furry socks. Oh, That's crazy, yeah. Very good, very good. Nice. It's the DJ gang. It's like showing up here. Always, always. It's like we're auditioning for DJs. <laughs> Number 37. That's right. He looks familiar to me. All, all Persian. Yes. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Oh, I gave you a high five. <laughs> Good time to so fun. Oh, yeah. 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 That was about a man and his drum and how he loses the love of the drum and then finds it again. But really at the end of the day, this is Mark's testament that he wanted to share about his love of this instrument, about how much it's meant to him. And uh, he's doing that tonight through words that are gonna be played on audio and visuals and also just you guys being able to rock out on his music. Woo! So, yes. <laughs> and because we want you all here like family, please feel free to clap when you're feeling it, because that's what this drum has brought him and so many other people, is really the, the emotion, the beat, the rhythm of life. So more than anything, Mark is here to share this beautiful drum with you all, and thank you so much for coming. And I totally goofed and did not get any of the refreshments, I promise. So just go outside and hug. <laughs> thank you guys so much again, and uh, please feel free to record. Uh, no flash, and enjoy the show. Thank you, Miriam. for this. I dreamt about winning the Oscar and it's here today. Uh, Mr. Tarantino, thank you for believing me. I, I really 
You know, let, let, sorry, I'm over the place, but I have to say something. When I when I got the call, and I always find my drunk husband, yes, I hold her back more than I do. She trusts me. She grew up with me since I was four. She helped me heal my traumas from the war. She told me, just take care of me. I will give you a strong cord to fight to make a living as an artist. While you move your face and put me down for your movies, you'll come back to see me where you left me, not in the movies. She says, I am real. I am here. I'll let you touch me, play with me, bend me softly. I am faithful. Not like you, you cheat on me and now I'm fearful. What if you leave me one day and you leave me forever because you're shy? I'm not big enough and now you're clever. Hey, my drum won't, please trust me. Give me another chance to live, to enjoy life, to give you love, but I can't help it. I need a glance at the stars every night to see where I am. I can't find myself even though I put these old glasses. I'm really mad. I can't figure out, should I break my glasses? I guess not. I should be patient, I know. I know I'm somewhere in the middle, on my way to Earth. I am sure I am, and yes, I'll give you a cuddle. With your amazing, beautiful songs, you will lead me to my dreams. You will take me to the place I want where the movie streams. She says, forget about the movies. Forget about your dreams. Just wake up. You're already a star. Look in the mirror and stop looking so far. I love you, my drum, and thank you for your love, I promise you. I will never, ever leave you my love.
trapped in my dreams. I'm not talking about the ones in your sleep. I'm talking about the dreams you change your life for. I want to be free, that's why I'm following them, but I'm trapped with them, obsessed with them. I cannot do stupid stuff like I used to do. Fuck them. Man, it's hard. I want them so bad. I became like a soldier in the war. I don't laugh hard anymore. I don't laugh from my core. I smile, that little smile for a headshot, for a job. I don't even know if I want it, but it's an opportunity that I can't miss it. Maybe it will lead me to the real job. I don't even know what the real job is. I am lost. And my drum will find me.
It's always good to love and connect. It's good, it's always good to be you, beautiful and neglect. All the bad, focus on the good. Learn, evolve and rise. Life is short, one shot in the body. So make the most of it and rise. Give love, happiness, respect and honesty. Listen carefully to the noise, to the silence, even when it sounds bad. Because it's always good, honestly, just focus on the good. Cause it's always good. It's always good. Thank good. Be good. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. That was the show. Thank you so yeah. much. Everybody. myself and um, thanks for you believing in me when I couldn't see myself she did everything by the way the videos the, uh, the yeah. flyers yeah. Yeah. thank you everybody I, I love everybody everybody that showed up today means a lot for me that you guys see me like that I would like to end the show by a, a drum solo live drum solo I'd like to invite my best friend Marcus to join yeah. 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 So, uh, Donovan, by the way, since we're, it's a family show, that's the show, by the way. You guys like that? <laughs> uh, let me introduce Donovan. Donovan, 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 Donovan had the best like uh, studio you could ever see in your life. Actually, I had you in a movie scene, by the way. I told you one time. So I moved to LA, right? And then I'm lost, I wanna be an actor, nothing wrong in it, but I'm saying, so then, then Marcus takes me to Donovan's spot and I see this studio, you know, they say I caught, they say he caught out back home, I caught, and I just go inside and I see all this like Middle Eastern people loving drums. Like he got like 20 drums over there, I'm hating on it. And I'm hating on it. And I see this American guy had all these drums, like what the fuck? And then I meet my wife there, <laughs> drumming on, on, on a drum. And I'm like, all of this just, it makes a lot of sense right now. I'm so happy I'm here and I would like to jam with you guys. You know? Woo! So, yeah. Yeah. Like the old days. Yeah, like the old days. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can play on this one. Yes. I'm in the middle of this. Yeah, you're in the middle of this. Woo! 
Cool. Okay. Thank you, everybody. Let's uh, just jam.
I've got a I was 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 I